guys, it's Michelle, and I bought a reborn doll, and um, I'm having trouble bonding with her, so I thought I would try to repaint her. And what I'm doing is I'm stripping the paint. I started a little bit right here, so I'm going to show you how I strip paint on my reborn dolls. So, first of all, I get this, any brand will do, nail polish remover. It has to be... 100% acetone to get the because you want the one with 100% acetone to get the paint off and I use paper towels and for like little crevices like in the nose and in the ears I'll use q-tips so what I do is I take the nail polish remover make get it on my paper towel nice and wet and then I start scrubbing and as you can see it takes off the paint you just gotta keep scrubbing scrubbing and once that side of the towel gets full of paint you use a different side and you keep scrubbing So I feel bad stripping her paint, but um, I just kind of want to customize her to a little bit and make her feel like my baby. <laughs> so anyways, so I'm going to strip, 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 and then keep, and then if the towel is too dirty to strip anymore, then I will use a new one. So I'll just get another towel. Do the same thing, make it wet. You can see, and just keep stripping. And I'll do the same thing with her legs, with her arms and everything, and just keep taking the paint off. And as you see, the paint starts coming off. So it will take me a while to do it. Um, I'm in no hurry, so it may take me a day or two. And then after I'm done stripping the paint, I take the Reborn kit and um, I will scr scrub it with Dawn dish soap, rinse it off, and let it dry. And I use air dry paints with my when I paint, so I will get the tile medium and dab that on with a cosmetic sponge. And I'll show you the process as I'm doing that. But as you see guys, it works pretty good at taking the paint off. If somebody used a marker, it probably wouldn't work. I don't know. But it comes off really pretty good for me. So that's my little tip, and I've done several babies this way, and so far it hasn't damaged the kits. So, but I don't leave the acetone on there forever. As soon as I'm done stripping the paint, then the doll is getting a bath with like Dawn dish soap. If you don't have Dawn dish soap, then you can try another, you know, hand washing the dishes soap. You could probably even take it and give it a good rinse in the shower or wherever. But this is what I do. So I will do another video and to show you guys how she's turning out. Oops, don't spill the... And don't be like me and spill the nail polish remover. So thanks for watching, guys. And remember, you're never too old for dolls. Bye!